Nicole, do you actually want to just jump off mute real quick and ask your question? Hi, Tatiana. This has been fabulous. And if you haven't written a book, you should, because I'd buy it. This is amazing info. And I've read a lot of books about community. So my question is, I've, I'm sliding into stage two. We had a single tier for the first, the initial launch, the beta launch. We think that there's interest in a higher tier, a premier tier. Is it a good or bad idea as you go into stage two to, to add a second tier, or is that splitting your focus and just focus on one tier instead? Yeah, the thing to think about if you're doing that is whether the two tiers are end up get, are gonna end up being two different people or if they're just the same person at a different stage or with a slightly different problem. If it's two different people, then you're gonna end up building two different communities and that's really distracting. If it's like more of, oh, this is the same person, but they just want this one extra thing that we're doing, which is what Liz did in Girls Club Collective. Like she had already been doing the mastermind and she just did a community that was like a lighter version of that. And those are the same people. They're, the lighter version is just people who are busier and who don't want to have a commitment of a weekly event every week. So yeah, that's how I would approach it. Thank you. That was super helpful.